to bring you some other world news now. And Ukrainian forces have withdrawn from some areas in the northeast of the country days after Russia launched a fresh offensive in the Kharkiv region. Now, meanwhile, President Zelensky has postponed planned foreign trips that underscoring the challenges are on the front line in the northeast for Ukraine. It is an issue that Antony Blinken, the top American diplomat, has been discussing today during a visit to the Ukrainian capital. Earlier today, he announced fresh military aid. Uh, but today I want to add to that by announcing that we will provide an additional $2 billion in foreign military financing for Ukraine. And we put this together in a first-of-its-kind uh, defense enterprise fund. And it has three components. Uh, one is to provide weapons today, uh, so this will assist Ukraine in acquiring those weapons. Two is to focus as well on something that Dimitro just talked about, investing in Ukraine's defense industrial base, uh, helping to strengthen even more its capacity to produce what it needs for itself, but also uh, to produce for others.